Welcome back to Pacific Northwest Explored. We're camping on the Capalis River and paddleboarding into the mysterious ghost forest. So come along. Quick stop at Dairy Queen in Aberdeen. We're on our way to the ghost forest. As soon as I have this uh, Sunday, we'll be back on the road. We're gonna check out the Green Lantern Pub. Here we are at Kapalis River RV Park. And I've snagged a little tent side here. So the river is right here. I'm just right opposite the river. Inside number four. Pretty sweet. There's a trail right here. Alright, camp is all set up. Time to have a snack. I'll give you a walk around of the campsite in a minute. Mm. Alright, I got camp all set up. I'll give you a walk through. This is the wilderness pop top tent made in the back in the 80s. Got a bit of sun right here. And then I've got a rhino rack uh, dome tent off the back. Let's take you inside. It's just me on this trip. This will be our second trip to Capella, so I just bought my little table and chair. Got my slide out fridge. Put all our food in for the weekend. Bodega. I can get about 98 hours continuously off of this EcoFlow Delta battery that I have powering it. So I don't even bring any solar panels this time. Climb up in here. After you pop the tent up, you've got standing room in here. So here's the bed on one side. And I can even stand on the bench. So here's the other side. Wood stove. I won't be using that today. It's pretty warm. Uh, but yeah, that's the setup. You might just go for a little recon paddle today. But here's a good shot between the trees. Of our campsite. This is about high tide. 240, it looks like it's still flooding. Before I get on the water, I just checked the tides at the coast, and uh, it looks like, because this is a tidal river I'm going on, uh, high tide is about in about 15 minutes. All right, we're putting in. This is the campsite trail next to me. Oh yeah, this is perfect. This drops off right here. I think I'm gonna go down river. Ready to rock and roll into the wind. And we're up. Stopped in this little little bay here out of the wind. Pretty 
nice river. for today. We'll see you at the ghost forest tomorrow. There we go. Taking veggies tonight. those heat up steak on. Got my fire grill inside the fire pit. So, shouldn't take too long. The veggies are looking good too. So we'll have a great little dinner here at the campsite. Sun's just starting to go down. out there. Oh yeah. It's going to be a nice day. Got coffee on board. It's going to be a good day. Here's a pro tip for you. Cut your bacon up so it'll fit your pan before you leave the house.
breezy. We're just gonna eat right out of the bowl. A little bit of hot sauce, a little bit of, a little bit of salt, pepper. This will get us to the ghost forest today. Good luck with the fishing, man. Hey, thanks a lot. And we're off. I'm gonna wait for the tides to change to come back. to the bridge. Oh, there's an osprey flying up there. As soon as you get around the corner from the bridge, it's beautiful, secluded. But we are officially at the ghost forest. This place is amazing. As I paddle down the river with a little bit of the tide still with me, I'll uh, explain to you what happened here. Roughly 1700, there was a massive earthquake right off of the Washington coast here the subduction zone, the Cascadia Fault. It was a massive 9.0 magnitude earthquake and this whole west coast from Vancouver Island down to California basically dropped six feet, I think, in this area. And subsequently, that's why they call this the ghost forest. It, uh, all of these trees were dropped into the salt water and they just died standing. So there's still a lot of standing dead trees. Uh, pretty amazing place. I'll get the drone up and we'll see it from the air. Let's follow these kayakers as they enjoy the incoming tide and journey into the ghostly salt marsh and enjoy the untouched, mysterious, cocalus ghost forest. This ghost king cedar still stands tall and proud and demands respect as master of the ghost forest.
catch up to our kayakers as they push deeper into the forest. Thought I'd go a little further up the river. Got some good drawing shots for you. See if I can get up this little slough. Looks like it's pretty deep. Looks like it's still flooding in. Pretty cool. I'm right in the middle of the ghost forest. Oh, look at this old tree that's come down. Pretty cool. I don't think anybody's ever been up here. Wow, so cool. Over 300 years old. Beautiful old tree. Very cool. Well. I found some blackberries, so I'm going to have something to eat. Look at these, right next to the shore. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Mm. Thanks for tagging along with us today. I'm going to leave you with a link to Nick on the Rocks, a great scientific video. Check it out, and don't forget to subscribe. I'll leave you with their motto. No excuse not to explore. Join me next time.